At Avicenna, we're known as the leaders in micro-LED interconnects that are ultra low power and high density. When we say low power, we mean on the order of one picojoule per bit. This is because it's a micro-LED based link. It is a simple NRZ modulation model compared to typically five picojoules per bit or more for laser-based interconnects. When we say high bandwidth density, we're referring to about one terabit per millimeter shoreline density today, first generation, and this will be going to multiple terabits per millimeter in future generations. The trade-off you get with micro-LED interconnects, it's short reach. So we're typically going no further than 10 meters, which is plenty for AI scale-up networks. Lasers typically struggle past 85 degrees Celsius and start to fail at 100 degrees Celsius. We've actually run our LEDs up to 400 degrees Celsius uh, with no problem. This makes micro-LED interconnects ideally suited because of low power, high density and high reliability for AI scale-up networks. Today I'm going to show you the world's first 5-meter micro-LED based ASIC to ASIC interconnect. So what you can see over here is our 16 nanometer TSMC chip that has micro-LEDs flipped on and then there is a micro lens and a five meter uh, fiber cable that has 331 uh, series of fibers. That's then going to, again, the same 16 nanometer chip um, that has a receiver and a photodiode array on it. So what I want to show you first is a transmitter. What you can see over here is a bunch of different transmitters um, that are active at the moment. Over here, you can see the picojoule per bit consumption that is around 2.4. And over here, what you can see that is uh, we have our receiver and we can see the bit error rate for every single channel. What we do on the transmit side is we send a bunch of different PRBS patterns where we have a bunch of aggressors and in the middle we have the victims. And on the receive side, what we do is we show the bit error rate for every channel and we also show the power consumption, which is around 0.4 picojoules per bit. Over here, we are showing our 90 degree fiber attached to the surface of the die. Um, this is only about seven millimeters high. And what you can see over here is a bunch of our micro LED is turning on. Um, over here, we have a very standard connector. And what you will see over here is that this is a live demo. When I pull out this, all the micro LEDs uh, disappear. And then when I plug it back in, they're back on again. And you can see over here that crosstalk between the different channels is very, very low. Uh, and this is the first time we're showing this. TSMC enables us by providing a truly a 3D uh, chip technology. Why I'm saying 3D uh, is because it integrates the active silicon with the uh, interposer technology uh, with an embedded through silicon via. Helps us integrate our micro LED with a photo detector, which is also provided, provided by TSMC uh, using the uh, CMOS image sensor technology.